Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when you're unable to install Corel Draw 2023 on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer, especially Windows 11, if you're receiving warning 1946. Now, go to the download location and then the first step is to run the exe as an administrator. So make a right click and then click on run as administrator and then try to install it. If that does not work, you can if you have any third party antivirus in my case it's mcafee so if you have any antivirus program you have to disable the antivirus program when you are installing this corel draw till the time you are installing it you can turn it off and once you are done installing it you can always turn it on so in my case i have mcafee so you can open mcafee you can open your antivirus program whichever antivirus program you are using and then you can go to protection over here my protection and then you can turn off a real time scanning turn it off you can turn it off for 15 minutes or 30 minutes you can turn off and then again click on my protection turn off the scan for now then again go to advanced firewall you can turn it off for now and then you can make a right click and then click on run as administrator Click on yes to allow and then try to install it. Now you can uh, log in and then you can start using it. You should not receive the error. Sometimes if you have installed the store version of Corel Draw, in that case also you might face problem. In my case, I have not installed it. If you have Microsoft Store version, in that case you can go to settings and then you can go to apps, apps and features or install apps. If you find this from Microsoft Store, if you have this in my, from Microsoft Store, you can uninstall it and then restart your computer and then you can install it from the website. You can run the exe file and install it. But whenever you are installing it, make sure that you turn off your antivirus program. And once you're done installing, in my case, I'm already done. So you can always enable your, now you can turn on the antivirus. So I'm turning it on. Now once, it is done, you can always enable your antivirus program and that should help you to install it successfully. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.